Well, profits aren't as large as they've been in years past, and big tech companies are looking for ways to cut their costs. And that means layoffs. So far, Meta has already let go of 11,000 people, including one man in our area. Fox 13's Brian Jackson has his story, which is kind of a case study in the so-called tech bubble burst. This is, we're starting to see these numbers rise every day, it seems, or so. Now, a lot of employees in here, both Seattle and Bellevue, are part of this latest layoff. The first large-scale cuts in the company's 18-year history. Now, today, we got a chance to speak with Gabriel Rodriguez, who was just laid off late last week. He told us that he moved from Puerto Rico to Seattle for this job. He doesn't have any family or friends here in the area. He was only employed by Meta for about three months before these cuts. And he says employees first learned of the possibility of losing their jobs from watching the news. There has been some, some speculations and different news in the outside, different articles, different platforms. They were speaking about the layoffs but there wasn't any official communication from the company. So everyone was scared. We didn't have any details about when that were, was going to happen, if that was really true. And then suddenly on Wednesday of November 9, we received at like 5 a.m. PSD, an email from Zuckerberg uh, speaking about what is happening with the company and the new, the new approaches that he has to take and sacrifices of, of cutting some funds from different projects and shrinking the company size uh, to manage this quarter and the problems that they're confronting. Now, in that message to workers, which has since been posted online, Zuckerberg wrote in part, quote, I want to take accountability for these decisions and for how we got here. I know that this is tough for everyone, and I'm especially sorry to those impacted. We went on to say that each employee would get a specific email detailing what this means for them. Now, for those who are laid off, that means severance, with all remaining PTO being paid out, health insurance for six weeks, and 16 weeks of base pay. It's been difficult because I love my island i love puerto rico and i wasn't seeking to go to left the island but when i had this opportunity with a big tech company it was difficult to to not you know, not go with it and i just wanted to try out and have my first job experience with a big tech company and learn Rodriguez says both a lease and a car payment, and he says that he's worried about finding another tech job with tech companies because the likes of both Microsoft and Amazon are also announcing layoffs. Now, Meta was the first big tech company to start making some of these cuts, but according to the New York Times, Amazon is now cutting 10,000 corporate and technology jobs as soon as this week. When we learn more about what that means for employees here in Seattle, we're bringing those updates right here on Fox 13.